Hey, what is up guys? It's Caffeine Burger, and today um, I've got a few Call of Duty tips that are going to improve your game if you use these correctly and um, if you use them well. I'm actually going to take these off because I don't need them for audio and the music's really loud. So, first things first, I'm here in a private match game. I accidentally went to gun game, which doesn't really matter. But the first tip I'm going to talk about is something that's pretty cool. Um, T. Martin did it and showed it to uh, in one of his videos. So I think this is a really cool idea. So you see, oops, you see this window so right here I'm shooting at. If you run up and jump and time it right, you can jump and slide out the window and get an accelerated boost of speed while you are like going out the window. So. How you normal? How people would normally think to do it is run up and like press the button to jump over it, or also to climb out the window. But that doesn't get you very far, or and you don't go very far. So, uh, what the thing is is you run up, jump, and then you. S okay, I failed there. It's kind of hard to perfect. You have to get used to it. Um, but you run up, jump, and slide when you hit the window, and you see how I went flying out. And it gives you a super accelerated boost of speed. Um, this can really help if you're uh, trying to get really close to somebody who's right there on the ground. Say somebody's right there, and you're trying to get to them with, like, say, a shotgun because you want to be close range. You just go like this, and boom, you're right there. And they're dead. So, that's the first of three tips. Um, the second one is called a G slide, which I'm not the best at, but what you do is you, when you're running, you jump, you kind of do that, it, that was a little bit short, if you do it right you'll go a lot farther, um, you run, jump, and as soon as you jump you press the crouch button which makes you slide, and then you jump right in the middle of your slide to fling you forward, and I'll uh, see if I can do it here real quickly. Okay, if you go too long, I'm showing examples of how not to do it. If you go too long or too short, it bounces you right back up or you start to, your feet start to drag on the ground. So, you want to run, you want to run, jump, do it, and then there. That was a good one. Run, jump, like that. That's how you do it. And uh, it's it's a pretty cool thing, especially like say there's somebody around that corner and you know it and you want to come over quickly. You don't do that. You run, jump, and then I did that wrong. You run, jump, slide, or not. You run, jump, slide, and run, jump, slide, and shoot them with the G slide so it's hard to get used to it's hard to master but uh, if you get it down it should really help you so now the third tip is actually a controller tip that um, a setting that I like to use on the controller in Halo there was a setting called the bumper jumper which switched your tactical with your jump and if you notice here I'm gonna move my webcam down I have bumper jumper on so when I'm running and I jump that's how I do it, is pressing that right there, this button. This is how I jump. And then it switches my tactical to the X. So if I, I, I don't have a tactical because it's gun game. But this is what my X, that's what X would be, is my tactical. So let me just change the settings here, the controls, to, see it says bumper jumper. And um, def if I go back to default, you run and you jump, you have to take your finger off the stick and you can't look around. You notice I have my control freak on. Um, you can't look around when you jump. See, I'm already used to doing this. Um, you can't jump and look at the same time. But if you have it like this, we switch back to bumper jumper really quickly. Um, if I switch back to bumper jumper, you you notice how I'm running, and then I can and look around and shoot while I'm in the air and, and while I'm jumping. I can't aim 
unless I use both fingers. I'm not really a person that uses both fingers, but um, I have been trying to get used to using both fingers on this side at least, so I can like slide, jump, and aim, and hit somebody. So those are three Call of Duty Black Ops 3 tips that should help you improve your game. Let me know in the comments if they helped you. Um, they have been helping me, especially the bumper jumper. I really like the bumper jumper the best. But uh, they all help. They're all useful. So hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, be sure to leave a like. Subscribe for more videos. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. And drive safe.